We want to introduce you next to a group called the Children for Peace, the group established to involve Syrian newcomers to the community. It's a children's choir from the group that will be performing as part of the Canada 150 celebrations. We're now joined from Ottawa by president of the organizing group, the Humans for Peace Institution, Mohammed Jamal Al-Sharif, and choir member Hamza Ali. Thank you both for joining us. Thank you. It's our Thank pleasure. You. Tell me, Mohammed, how the opportunity came about for the choir uh, to participate. So we started uh, with the Syrian refugee children. Uh, the aim of uh, this group was to involve them and engage them in the community, especially in the local community. So we start with uh, several initiatives, one of them Heart to Heart. Uh, this is an initiative to support uh, the local children hospital in, in Ottawa, which is called CHIO. And today we handle a check of $5,000. Uh, all this money was proceeds and fundraised by the Syrian children to give back to the community. Wow. Uh, Hamza, tell me about uh, the choir and why you decided to be a part of it. And tell me how you feel about performing in public. First, hello to everyone. Second, uh, I feel very, very good. Uh, I want to give back to Canadian and I want to thank all the Canadians for help, helping us, and thank you very much. How long have you been in Canada now? I think just one year. Okay, and what's it been like for you? I, I like I like everything. I like the people, I like the hockey, I like, I like the animals, the trees, I like everything. Mohammed, what's it like for you to see a group like the choir come together and be able to perform and, and integrate themselves into the community? For sure, uh, helping children to give back in the community is, is an important issue. But with these Syrians who uh, had issues back home with, the, with, the, with you know, wars and disasters, they've been uh, away from their real homes, you know, for long. So, being here and having a real home, it's it's very important for them. So we want to let them know that this is their home now, and it's they are part of this community. They they have to give back. They we are trying to put the seeds in them, and I, I hope the seed will grow up and make a real tree in the future. These are the future of our country. So. Let me ask you uh, a little bit more about the organization because we're talking about the choir, but obviously it's much bigger than that. Can you tell me a little bit more about it? Yeah, our organization is only two years old. It's uh, registered here, uh, here in Canada and uh, in the UN. It's an NGO, a non-for-profit. Uh, we are uh, having five chapters now around the world. Uh, the main idea of our organization is to promote peace locally. So we are trying to help others in our communities because we believe that uh, helping others, drawing a, pic a smile on other people's faces, it's, it's the message of peace. So. We're trying to promote that all over the world. And so far, we have a huge success and, and a lot of people trying to join us because this message, it's the universal message. It's the message that everybody loves. So, Hamza, when are you going to be performing uh, for the 150? And how do you feel? Are you nervous at all? For, no, I'm not nervous. <laughs> You're not nervous? I, yeah. But, uh, we're going to... In Canada Day, we're going to have a tent and uh, we're going to have Syrian culture and we're going to have music, dance, and we're going to sing everything. All right. I'm sure it will be a lot of fun. Have a great day. And thanks for joining us yeah. today. Mohammed Jamal Al-Sharif, Hamza Ali, both joining us out of Ottawa. Thanks, you guys. Thank you. Thank you very Thank much. You.